you're not where you want to be with God. Okay? And that's it's a true spot to be in. I've been there. All right? I don't know how many times this man, this man, this guy has reached out and been like, hey, you doing all right? And that, you doing all right? It was like, hey, you okay? And it's one of those that you snap out of your trance because life will tell you that these things are okay. And they are. But once again, it's stuff that happens here. The things that we've got to focus on is more than here, okay? Because once you turn your eyes up there, it'll change your mouth, it'll change your heart, and what comes out, what's in your heart comes out your mouth, okay? Right. Once you make a happier heart, it makes a happier life, it makes a happier household, it makes a happier acquaintance with your co-workers, it makes you be a happier person, and it may not be that you are completely torn up and in the absolute depths, and you're as far away from God as you could possibly be, because the, the, those, those cases are there. But there's also those cases that are right on the outskirts of true happiness, but they're too afraid to take that step over. And when you take that step over, all right, we did that in December. We were, our, our life was okay. We were happy. But the true happiness of when we stepped from being a house that called on God when we needed him, letting God lead our lives, that, that's a big step. But it's also a very small step. It's just a mindset. We don't help you get there, all right? That's the big, that's, that's, it's so true and so easy that once you do it, you're like, man, it's like Google it. Like, why was I going to stand there and watch everybody else's true happiness instead of jumping over? It's, it's not a river, guys. It's a little puddle. It's a muddy puddle, as Lana says. Jump over it. Run through it. I don't care. And you get to true happiness. Because once you get there, you won't go back. Right. You may fall. But he'll pick you up in that relationship that you build while you're in true happiness. It's the difference than where you were on the outskirts. When you fall on the outskirts, you're like, oh my goodness, I took another seven steps from the money puddle. No, I know I'm not going to get there. Maybe next week. No, it's get back up. And up. Sorry, God, I, 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 I got this. And you take off with him and run again. It's, it, there's going to be tripping blocks. There, there, there's absolutely is. But just get closer with him, and it will make your whole life happier. And your acquaintances, your surroundings, everything will change just because the love that you have in your heart, the light that he puts in there, shines through. And when it shines through, it changes the complexion of everything around you. You may stub your toe, and it, it, you, you may yell. It's going to hurt. But you may not yell the awful things that you used to yell. Okay. It's, a, it's a small thing, but that's, that's a very small difference, but it will change the big things in life, too. And you will struggle less, or I wouldn't say struggle less, but your finances, everything will fall into place once you put things in prioritize. That he is who he is, and he gives the top. Once you look at him, everything else has a light shown on it, and he will allow you to see and navigate through things in a lot easier fashion. Stubborn, bang your head against that door, hoping eventually it'll open instead of just listening to the door knock. Okay? Mm -hmm. It's that simple. If you got anything, I, there's no judgment. I'll talk to you, pray with you. If you just need somebody to talk to, oh, I, I don't care to be that guy. Because I was that guy that needed that not very long.